In this video, I'll show you how to download and install GIMP on Windows 10. If you don't know, GIMP is an alternative to Adobe Photoshop. It's a free alternative. It's free open source software. You can just search for GIMP. I'll include the link in the description of this video, but it's GIMP.org is the website. And from here, there's a button at this point in time. This is mid-2019. There's a download button. There's also across the top, we can go to the downloads area and just left click up here. And so this says you can download for Windows. Now, if you're familiar with um, torrenting software, you can download the BitTorrent version. Otherwise, you can just do the direct. I recommend you do the direct one if you're not sure. We can just left click here and do the direct download. It'll bring up a dialog where you can click Save File. And then it will save to your computer. So it automatically detects the version uh, of, of the computer and the operating system you're using and will find the appropriate download for you. If you visit this on a Linux or a Mac computer, this will be a, a different download for you. So just make sure you have the right one. You can also download older versions if you wanted to. So we have 2.1.0, 2.8. Once the download is complete, you can either left click on it in your downloads area, or you can navigate to the folder that you downloaded it to. In my case, it's my downloads directory. And you can find that download right here. So this is the GIMP point uh, 2.10.12. We just uh, double click on this or left click if you have single click enabled and then we'll click install for all users and then it brings up a dialogue asking if we trust the software you can go ahead and say yes on that and then choose your installation uh, language and then we'll click install and it'll take just a moment to finish doing the install we can minimize everything else now and this is just a program running on our computer that's installing and it's installing to program files gimp2 is the, uh, the directory where it's going to be installed to so we'll let this uh, finish installing real quick. And it looks like it's just about finished installing. And there we have it. We can click Finish. And now GIMP is installed on the computer. We can check that by just clicking in the bottom left-hand corner and typing in GIMP. We can also find it in our installed programs. Uh, we can create a launcher if we wanted to. So this is what the program looks like when it uh, first launches. We can also click in the bottom left-hand corner, type in GIMP again. But at this time, we can right-click on it. And we can say Pin to Start or Pin to Taskbar or we can open file location and find out where that's actually at and we can create a copy of it. We go to copy and then we can paste it on the desktop. So now we have a nice launcher here. We can just launch it quickly if we want to that way. Uh, but go ahead and if, uh, check out my other tutorials if you're curious about uh, learning how to use GIMP to do photo editing or create art uh, or just modify images. Uh, so hopefully you found this video informative. Go ahead and uh, leave your questions and comments below uh, if you have any and I look forward to catching you in the next video.